A shopping trip to Mike's Models. What did we get? Let's have a look, shall we? Roll the intros. YouTubers and welcome back to Chelmsworth Junction. I'm Peter. As the title suggests, I've had a little shopping trip and before everyone says, oh no, not another time you train shopping trip, this time it was for Mike's Models just outside of Warsaw off of Junction 7 of the M6. Um, got a bit of a bargain in there, got a bit of a deal. So without further ado, let's get down to baseboard level and let's have a look and see what we've got, shall we? So as you can see guys, we got a plain white bag this time. Now, first of all, we'll get the heaviest item out. And I've got the Wooden Scenics C1203 plaster cloth. Uh, this is gonna be for my hillside that's directly behind me at the moment. And um, that will hopefully be in the next uh, layout update video. So I've got some of the with the Scenics plaster cloth, never used it before. I've seen it being used by Charlie on Chadwick Model Railway. Uh, seems an easy product to use, so I thought I'd give this a bash, and if it doesn't come out well, you know, I could always rip it all out and start again. So that's the Wood and Scenics plaster cloth. I bought some Wood and Scenics Woodland Classics trees and these are the three to four inch classic early lights free pack and these were 13 pound 80 and these were from this everything that i bought today is from mike's models so they were 13 pound 80 so they're going to be going into my little park scene which you've all seen before um and it, it, it needs a bit of titivation, it needs a bit of height. And I thought, well, these were quite nice. They're not too big, they're not too small. I thought these, and with three of them, I didn't want to overdo it in the park. So I thought three, that would be quite nice enough. So that's the Wooden Scenics. And if you're interested in the product codes, let me see if I can find it for you. The item number is TR3506. Also, again, the Wooden Scenics Wooden Classics tree range. This is the two to three inch classic flowered trees. Um, and the item number on this one, if you want to know, is TR3593. And they will be going into my diorama for the church and the pub. And these will actually be going into the church yard. So that's for the church. Before I get to the next bit, I've also got the Pico station uh, nameplate boards. And it is item number 5095. And these are the modern type. You get four in a pack. And they are based on a water slide transfer. So obviously you're going to need a steady hand to do this. I will be doing a little other review video for this little pack. So keep your eyes open guys on my channel. There'll be a review for this one coming up soon. Last two bits are some lovely Mark II F Intercity coaches. Now these ones are, if I get them on the camera for you this one is r4919a and it's the br mark ii f second open coach in intercity executive livery and the coach number is 5988 and the second one item number is r4919 and it's a br mark ii F second open coach in city executive delivery and it is coach number 5985. Now, as you can see, the price states £31.50. 
Now, like I said, these are from Mike's Models. Now, he got, he gave me a deal on these. I said to him, is that the best you can do price-wise on that coach? And he was like, have you seen it cheaper anywhere else? And I was like, yes, I can get them in Tony's Trains of Rugby for £30 each or, you know, say three for £90. So you're saying £30 a coach if you're getting, you know, a set of three. So he went on to the website and looked it up on Tony's trains and yeah, he went, yeah, no problems. I could do it for 30 quid. So that's now taking my Mark II rake from three coaches up to five. So that's my little haul from Mike's models today. So we got the two Mark, two Mark II F coaches in instant delivery, the Wooden Scenics plaster cloth, two sets of Wooden Scenics trees, and a set of station name boards now i'm going to try these if they don't come out very well there is a company on the internet that will actually make you personalized ones for i think about five pound each these came out at four pound ten a pack so you know i'll have a go we'll have a review of it and see how we get on with it so that's the little haul that i got from my trip to my model today so there you have it guys that is my little haul from Mike's Models. Like I said, the Mark II F coaches were £31.50. He let me, let me have them for £30. But this is the thing, guys. When you go to Mike's Models, you've got to be able to prove um, via either on your phone, uh, right in front of him, or if he, if he goes on the internet, you must be able to prove where you can get them cheaper from and then he'll you know he'll cut you a deal like you know i've saved three pounds today on those coaches that three pounds all right probably cost me about three pound in diesel to get to mike's models because it's just up the m6 i'm junction four and they're at junction seven so you know three pound in diesel so you know i've saved some money on my diesel so that's a good thumbs up if you haven't been to mike's models i would suggest you really really good do go down and have a look He's not just model railways, he does airfix kits, all the Humbro paints and other companies make paints down there in acrylic, enamel. Um, he's got all the spray cans, the primers, brushes, thinners, glues. Um, he also does a massive, massive selection of rear control cars, planes, helicopters. He's well, well, well worth a look at, guys. So if you're ever in the vicinity of Warsaw Junction 7 of the M6, dive off the M6, dive into Mike's Models and have a look around. You never know, you might find a little item in there, like I did today, the station board nameplates for my station complex. Didn't expect to find them, found them, brought them home. We'll have a look, see what they're like. I'll do a video on them. You know, I might have to buy them buy some from off the internet that have been personalised for my layout. But my models, it's a little bit of a treasure trove. You never know what you're going to find in there. It's all new stuff in there. I think he does do a little bit of second hands, but all his prices are marked down from retail prices. You know, from like the big guns like, say, like Hatton's, Rails of Sheffield. They are usually a bit cheaper than the bigger brand companies out there, like I said. So... Get yourself down there, guys. Have a look. You never know, you might be able to pick up yourself a bargain. Hope you've enjoyed the video, guys. If you have, hit the like button down, down the bottom. If you want to leave a comment or ask a question on any of the products that I bought today, please leave a comment down below. If you're a subscriber, thumbs up. Just want to say a big thank you for the few people that have come onto the channel recently. Welcome aboard. Hope you're enjoying the content so far and hope you enjoy it future content and that goes to all my older subscribers as well hope that you're enjoying the content of the channel if you are give it a quick give the old uh, like button a click and if you are liking what you see leave me a comment if there's something you would like me to do a video on again leave a comment down below if you're not a subscriber why not join the channel it's growing really nicely the railway is growing slowly and at the moment, it's going slowly from a, a baseboard with a bit of track to a scenic railway. So if you're not a subscriber, you know what to do. Hit the subscribe button on the right-hand side. If you want to carry on watching videos from my channel, then there should be a link up here and up here. 
so you can carry on watching videos and I hope you do because you know it makes me feel that I'm doing something good and gives that information for you guys until the next time guys look after yourselves take care of yourselves but above all happy modeling bye bye from now until the next time bye bye